Good. I thought I heard you breathing. Oh, fuck you. That's what I want to hear. It means the shit hadn't broken you yet. <clears throat> okay. Why? Tied on your back. A dead dog chewing through its chains? <clears throat> Not something you see every day. <clears throat> I did some digging before we freed you. I was, um, I don't know, trying to make sense out of it. This was taken from the lieutenant when she came into the camp. My guess is, it's yours. Yeah, it's mine. And your wife's name? It ain't Beth. No, it ain't. And you've been out here all this time? Trying to find her? You just asked me why. <laughs> Pretty simple, really. The way I figure it, any man who goes through God knows what to find his old lady does not deserve to die at the end of a rope. Boy, wait, wait, wait a second. You're, you're, you're helping me? Well, that, that just means you're all gonna hang. We're not going back. The colonel is batshit crazy. <laughs> Holy war, genocide, I mean, what the fuck is that? Yeah, well then, what's the plan? What are you gonna do? We're going east. Yeah. Hopefully we can make it to Reno. You should come with us. Nope. Well, you can't go back. The militia will shoot no, you on I'm sight. No, I'm not leaving without her. Uh, and I gotta ride north. I gotta warn Iron Mike. It's way too late for that now. Why? Well, they spent all night clearing the Santiam Pass. What? A convoy rode out early this morning heading north. Oh, shit. Are you sure you don't want to come with us? Yeah, I'm sure. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Hey, uh, uh, Corey. When I told the Colonel about my military service, I told him I hated every goddamn minute of it, but, uh, maybe it wouldn't have been so bad if... I'd served under someone like you. You know, maybe it's not too late. Gotta get back to Lost Lake. I gotta head north. I gotta save Boozer. Mickey. Iron Mike. I, I can't save Sarah. I can't save Sarah, but I can save them. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry. I am not giving up. I'm gonna find a way to come back for you. I swear to God. I am coming back for you. I gotta head north. Take the uh, Sandium Highway. It's clear. Okay, here we go.
You all go! Yeah, that's what I thought. More scrap.
Booze, are you there? Come back. Booze, man, come back. Deke, is that you? Yeah, move in here, goddammit. Addy, get wounded inside. Boozer! Deke, glad to hear you were there, brother. We sure could use you about now. Get him inside. Move, damn it, move. You should look out. I'm coming, Boozer. I'm almost there. Uh, Schizo. Schizo. He's there, Boozer. He's coming for you. They're, they're coming in through the gate. Go, go. Let him come, Deke. Let him come. Boozer! Damn it. Ricky, lost leg camp, come in. Ricky, I hear Mike, come in. Deke, you're alive. Schizo said you were dead. Hey, hey, they're pulling out. They're on the run. We got him. We got him. Where's Schizo? Has anyone seen Schizo? We did it, man. Right on, yeah. dude. Go after him. Don't let him get away. Kill him. Damn Where the hell is Schizo? Bunch of us have been looking for him. No one's seen him. Hey, come on. We gotta go. Hey, don't worry. We're gonna find that asshole. <sighs> Deke, thank God. Come on. Ricky, what's going on? It's Iron Mike. He got shot. Hey, you lazy son of a bitch. I wanted to... See, if you wanted to go fishing, we got a camp to feed. <coughs> you found her? You found her? You're a lady. Yeah, Mike, she's right outside. She, she's here? Yeah. Yeah, look, I, uh, I couldn't have done this without your help. No easy way to say this. Iron Mike's dead. He stopped. He tried to stop Schizo. When the militia were pulling out, Iron Mike being Iron Mike, tried to reason with him, and... Okay. Yeah, I... Shut up! Shut up! This ain't no eulogy. Iron Mike wouldn't want that. We don't have time for this because... Because the men that we killed today... Well, there's more where that came from. A lot more. I've been to their camp. I've seen their army. And when they come back here, they're gonna slaughter each and every one of them. At least they're gonna try. Unless we hit them first. 
Hey! Hey, shut up! Shut up! Listen to him. Iron Mike trusted him, so you have to trust him! No, 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 I'm sorry. You know what? I can't do this. I'm not Iron Mike. I'm not goddamn drunk. You're right. There's a road. No, I'm not fucking leaving. Look at me. Listen. All right. If I'm Boozer, tell me maybe like how it. Okay, so I found this in a survivalist bunker. Wait, this is... Yeah, yeah, we're gonna need a truck. Something big, something like a dub truck. And we're gonna fill it full of uh, fertilizer. nitrate? Yep. We're gonna mix it with 100 gallons of creosote. A fertilizer truck bomb. That's your plan. Oh, my God. The militia have turned this entire island into a fortress. And I got civilians in the caves. You got the labor force and those considered unfit to serve in the survivor camp. And you got the armory and the garrison right by the main gate. We hit that. We tear out the heart of the colonel's militia. What about Sarah? Well, I mean, she's in the caves. It's what the colonel calls the Ark. But how, how do you know that they're not just going to kill everybody? Sarah, Sarah and everyone else. I, I don't. I don't. But I figure that the explosion will cause so much confusion and chaos that they're I can go in, I can find her, I can get her out before they know what hit her. Look, this isn't about just Sarah anymore. The colonel has declared war on all of us, and he's got an army to back him up. Iron Mike and the rest of them are just the first casualties in that war. <laughs> it's gonna be a short one unless we hit them first. <sighs> I didn't say it was a good plan. No, it's a really shitty one, You with me, brother? Oh, I wouldn't miss it. Okay. Well, we're not going to be able to do it alone. All right, okay, well, if anyone wants to join in, you hit him. You hit him at the south gate. Mm -hmm. Because when the explosion happens, all the militia, they're going to rush up toward the main gate. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to need some supplies. How's it coming? Back up. Hey, Deke. <sighs> hey. Uh, what's this? Oh, ask him. Well, truck's as big as a tank, right? Uh-huh. I figured. Might as well turn her into one. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, is this ready? Well, let's see, Deke. Time to fill her up. I know where to find some fertilizer. I'll radio when I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted you to know. Look, when Corey busted you out, the colonel, you went crazy. Thought she was in on it. He lost his goddamn mind. He went after Lieutenant Whitaker. He was gonna kill her, Dick. Dick! Yeah, I'm listening. But I stopped him, Dick. I did. I told him that all that poison shit she's cooking up, maybe we use it to kill the freaks, but maybe we don't. Maybe there's an enemy camp. Maybe they got one water supply. Maybe dumping a gallon of hemlock into that, maybe that solves a lot of problems. Anyway, the Colonel, he likes that idea. So he puts me in charge of the Ark. Wants me to keep it safe. She reports to me now, Dick. To me. What? Schizo. Bro, I just wanted to warn you. They're coming. I can't stop them. They're coming, and this time, this time the Colonel's bringing the whole damn house. Uh, well, let them. We're not going anywhere. 
And when he comes this time, we'll be ready for him. Hey, Deke. Captain, the Colonel's waiting. I'll be there, goddammit! Now get out! Hey, Deke. Look, I gotta go. But, uh, I'll tell Lieutenant Whitaker that you send your best wishes. Captain Sarkozy signing off. Just a few. More. Yeah, Ricky, I'm here. I just wanted to say thank you for coming back to help us. I'm just sorry I was too late. You weren't. We'll stop him. Schizo, we're gonna stop him, right? Yeah, we're gonna stop him. I wanted to say I'm, s I'm sorry about your... about Sarah. I can't imagine what you must be going through losing someone t twice like that. Hey, I haven't lost her yet. We're building a really big bomb, remember? Well, we're... Glad to have you back. Lost Lake needs you. Hey, Ricky. Uh, it, it wasn't his fault. You know, uh, I or Mike. I mean, he was. He was only trying to do the right thing. I know. Ricky, help. And that, my friend, is all of them. Jesus. Uh, booze man. You there? It's clear. You can, uh, have Ricky move the truck over. Copy that. Hey, Dick. I got a surprise for you, brother. Oh. oh great. That's great. Can't wait. Dick and I. What the hell is that? A little gift from Ricky. Still can't ride a bike, but I can shift the hell out of these gears. Wow. I uh, pull it over there. All right. Okay. Oh, God. That ought to be enough. All right. What's next? <sighs> Creosote. I'll ready you with you when I'm ready. Where the hell are we gonna get a hundred gallons of creosote? You don't wanna know. talk to you. Ricky, what's wrong? Uh, militia. What? Where? Boozer thinks they might be planning another attack, so he asked me to send you to take a look. Goddamn militia. Yeah, I got this. <sighs> Thank God. I'll let Boozer know. Ricky out.
Copeland. Yeah, yeah, I'm here. I'm uh, guessing you uh, got another job for me. Okay, I'll swing by. Deacon up. I can talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. Deke, did you find him? Uh, yeah. I hear gunshots. Jesus. Well, bring back his headscarf. Dan's people want proof that Harper is dead. Yeah. Yeah, okay, well, it, it might be a little bit. Come on!
militia. Damn it. More of them. Is that how you got? Come on, you sons of bitches. There we go. Come on, let's do this. Melissa, come on! Almost out. Hey, Ricky, it's done. Thank God. All right, I'll let Boozer know. Ricky out. Come on, get him inside. What happened? I got hit again. The squatters off the highway. We've got to get some men together, go after them. Don't look at me, it ain't my problem. They've got Manny. You sent Manny on a supply run. I just run the camp, D. I don't tell folks how to live their lives. Go to hell, Cope! I used to be a cop. I found his bike. I'm gonna see if I can track him down. My men said they'd set up an ambush on the Sanium. Yeah, I already found it. Deacon out. Fresh meat.
I wasn't gonna let him kill you. Besides, who the hell is around here knows how to rebuild a carburetor? Just back up. Nice and slow. Don't make a sound. It's clear. I've been camping too long. Never saw nothing like that. Yeah, okay. Let's get the hell out of here. You ain't gotta twist my arm on that one. <laughs> yeah, so what the hell happened? What were you doing out here? I don't know. I hadn't been on a run in months. Felt like maybe I wasn't well, doing my share, you know? A lot of assholes with guns out here, Manny. Not many know how to fix the shit that they ride around on. Yeah, yeah, that's what Cope said. Yeah, for once I agree with the son of a bitch. So 
Now, what do you think? Why's it gotta be this way? Be what way? Everyone out here trying to kill everyone else. <sighs> Manny, you know how many folks were locked up in prisons before the ship went down? I mean, here in the States... Wow, no idea. Two and a half million. You count the ones that are out on parole and probation, that's almost seven million, so... One in 35 was someone who didn't give a shit about the law. You good from here? Yeah, yeah. Hey, Deke, I owe you, man. I'd be dead right now if you hadn't... Manny, nose down. Nose down. They feed you. Now get the hell out of here. Easy, right? I just gotta make sure I have enough uh, traps. Heading to the old sawmill. They got a couple of storage tanks there. They should have over here. So the old sawmill. Last I checked, there's a hole there. Big goddamn hole. Yeah, I'm uh pretty sure I knew that. What, you still got a death wish? I mean, even after finding your old lady, Deke, we're gonna get her back. Who's man? No, no, I don't. Look. Handle this. Just be ready. I'll radio when it's clear to bring your rig in. Geeking out.
were saying something? Boozer just told me you're heading to the old sawmill. Uh, yeah, and Boozer has a big mouth. He is head of security. He has to tell me. You remember when I took you to the sawmill, right? You remember me showing you the there? Yeah, I remember. The really big boy that lives, sleeps, and eats there. Uh, yeah, like I said, I remember. Uh, look, Ricky. When I was with the militia, they, uh, we... We created a sort of souped-up Molotov. A souped-up Molotov? Yeah, yes, it's like napalm. Anyway, trust me, I got this. We need you, Deke, alive. Ricky, just be fine. You don't gotta worry about me no more, okay? I know what I'm doing. Ricky? Yeah. Okay. And in this case, some big goddamn Molotovs, but you know, you get the idea. Yeah. <laughs> 
Holy shit, dude. Looks like I missed all the fun. Yeah. Next time, I drive the truck. You fight the freakers. Yeah, brother. Okay, just pull it over there. All right, you got it. <laughs> all right, that's it. Head back to camp. I'll meet you there. <clears throat> all right. And, uh, booze man. Drive carefully. <laughs> what do you think? That I'm gonna blow myself up? 